Hello and welcome to another episode of Sarda TV. My name is Sarda and I'm just going to do a quick review on the armors that have been released. During the week, MMO Champion released the remaining T-sets from the fast arriving Cataclysm. At this point in time, I'd like to point out I think Blizzard done a better job on the graphics of the armor than our current Wrath of Lich King expansion. The first one up is the Hunter. Now, it's a bit too colorful for my liking, but I'm sure others will enjoy it. And I'm not one of the people who are a fan of the Murloc, so I really don't like the helmet. So I would probably have the helmet turned off for this one. Overall, not a bad job. Next up, we have my favorite class, the Paladins. Now, I think this is just a copy of the T6 and the T4 ma matched in together with the with the jeweled armor as well. It's a bit too feathery looking. The colors aren't too bad. The helmets are appalling. Uh, overall, probably not a very good job. Which is unfortunate because I play a Paladin. I'll have to look at this a little bit, but them's a the breaks. Here we have Death Notes, and I really like these ones. The synergy of the armor all seems to flow into one. The colors are great. The just enough effects around the shoulders and the helmet. Although I'm not a big fan of the crown. Overall, I like this one a lot. Here we have the mages. I think they really lucked out because I think they've done a really good job on the mage armor set for Cataclysm. Now, it could be considered a little bit too warlocky, but I think if mages are going to play fire, then the, the whole Bernie aspect of the thing kind of fits in really well. It might even make me play my, my mage a little bit more. Now for a quick look at the priest. I don't like the teardrop on the helmet and how they've copied the, the mage tier 2 shoulders. But apart from that, the rest of the armor doesn't look too bad. It seems to flow not too bad. The chest goes into the belt, a uh, bit of a sharp line. Uh, overall, I, I don't mind it. I certainly wouldn't play with the helmet on this one again. But apart from those two, two little things, uh, I give it a thumbs up. Last of my list, and certainly not by the least, we have the shamans. Now, they seem pretty plain. Although the armor appears to flow fairly well with the shamans, it's only broken up by a couple of little color streaks running through the legs and something hanging off the shoulder. The The helmet has some weird hooks running through it, one on the nose and one on the right cheek. It doesn't really make sense. Shaman's more of a, a, a blunt weapon, earthy, elementally type type sort of a class, so I don't understand the, the, the look that the blizzard was going for here. So. Not bad. Again, I really think that Blizzard have done a much better job in this this patch coming than in previous patches coming with the armors. At least they look completely different. We're not all the same. Hope you enjoyed my class reviews. So please remember to subscribe, rate, comment the videos as it will give me inspiration to do some more.